doing an empties video, products that I have used up. I sent out a tweet on Twitter and I asked if you guys like these types of videos because I just wasn't sure. And I said favorite this tweet if you want an empties video and I got 40 favorites in one minute. So I was like, girl, I gotta do one. Here's my bag of emptied products. So basically what an empties video is, if you're not sure, it's products that I've used up all the way until they are empty. Like an amped up favorites video because it's things that you've loved so much that you used up, not just like things that you're loving for the month. I usually always have a mouthwash. This one is the Listerine Ultra Clean Anti-Stain Antiseptic mouthwash. Anti antiseptic? Okay, cool. This is a mouthwash. I love the Listerine mouthwashes. They have that just like cooling sensation and really get your mouth clean. Tanning lotion. This is my favorite tanning lotion ever. This is the Rasta Infinite Bronzing Hemp Elixir. Some people are like, oh my god, it's a weed leaf. It's a hemp leaf. Hemp seed oil hydrates the skin with the highly evolved balance of essential fatty acids, amino acids, and vital nutrients. So just to clear that weed leaf up. <laughs> I use this in the tanning bed. A couple hand soaps. I have two here from Bath and Body Works. These ones are both the um, deep cleansing ones like with the beads in there. I have so many soaps with the beads in them so I've been trying to use them up because I prefer the foamy ones now. So I'm just trying to you know clean out my collection and I've got them down so much. I used to have like my underneath of my sink was full of Bath and Body Works soaps and now I only have like five or ten ish so I'm very happy that I'm actually using them up this one is the Caribbean escape I love this one it was very fresh I don't like the taste of coconut but I love like the smell and the freshness of it it was just like how it's pictured here it smelled like florally coconut and then this one was sparkling pink champagne I bought this one just mainly because of the bottle like it's pink sparkles and it's cute and um, it's actually pink in there I didn't love it overwhelmingly but I did like it it was a good scent would I repurchase it Probably not, but that's the Joy Bath & Body Works. You can try so many different scents. A Joyco shampoo, the K-Pack collection, the color therapy. This is the shampoo that I use on a daily. I love it so much. And this one's just the shampoo to preserve color and repair damage. So that's exactly what I need. I want my color to stay and I don't want to have damaged hair. Um, so that's that. And then I have also an empty conditioner to go along with it. Exact same K-Pack collection. This one is for the same thing to preserve color and repair damage. I've repurchased those numerous numerous amounts of times I love them I have another empties this one is the Joyco intense hydrator um, treatment for dry damaged hair I do not have dry damaged hair but I use this on my ends mainly I'll basically use it right on my ends and then up to about here it doesn't matter if I put it up here but that's just where I focus it on it's beautiful stuff it smells so yummy and it just like makes your hair feel like butter like when I run my fingers through it it just like slips through and I'm like smashing my hand on the side of the back Tub. I'm like, wow, that's how smooth it is. <laughs> I got two body washes. The first one here is the Pure Seduction by Victoria's Secret. I actually, this is my most recent empties. I actually just finished this today in the shower. So, so good. Pure Seduction. Mm, Nina gave this to me. She also gave me like so many other things from the Pure Seduction line. I'm pretty sure she gave me the whole line, like shower gels, perfumes, body sprays, stuff like that. And it's so yummy. And then the other body wash that I have is another one of my faves and it's Twilight Shower Gel. This is from Lush. So good. I love Twilight. I'm pretty sure you can only get this during Christmas. Christmas time. Oh, it smells like the best thing ever. They recreate the magical moment betwixt day and night with this sparkling, soothing lavender and tonka gel. Perfect for calming kids and adults on Christmas Eve. Oh, girl, smell this. Like, go into Lush and smell this if it's out. Um, it should be in season right away if it is, you know, just Christmas. Views by November 2014. Oh, oh no, packed on November 2014, used by January 2016. So I have used it up by then. I was like, cool, I was using expired stuff. This that I used up, this is the Label M Protein Spray for your hair. When I blow dry my hair, I put on not too many products. I used to overload the amount of products on my hair. And then recommendations from you guys were like, you don't need to overload because you don't want to clump up your hair's, you know, cuticles and stuff like that. You want to keep it as fresh as possible. So I used this, an argan oil, and a heat protection spray. That's what I use. And this one is a protein spray. So basically what my hairdresser told me is when you do anything, you lose protein in your hair and your hair is made up with proteins. So when you wash your hair, you lose proteins. When you dry your hair, you lose proteins, brushing, you know, everything like that. So this gives you that protein back. And I do see a difference. It keeps my hair shiny. And I do see a difference when I don't use it. Not like overwhelming, like my hair is really bad, but I do, I can tell. Room spray 
It is a concentrated room spray, cinnamon frosting, Bath and Body Works holiday traditions. Looks like this. It's tiny. I have about like five-ish of these in my bathroom and I keep one out at all times on top of the toilet in case somebody comes over or an adult and go to the washroom and it smells. You just need one spray of this and it's good. Don't spray two, don't spray three. I always say that when I have these, but literally one spray. And this is so good, the cinnamon frosting. All year round, I use this, obviously, because I just used it up maybe like two months ago. All right, I have a toothpaste. This is Colgate Optic White. Icy Fresh, whiter teeth in one week. I do notice a difference, because right now I'm using a different toothpaste, and I do see my teeth going a little bit yellowy. My teeth aren't yellow, but when I use the Optic White, my teeth are just like, whoosh, like white all the time. So A plus. I have a deodorant that I used up a while ago. I just keep these collecting. Um, so all of this has been collecting since my last empties video. So this one is Cocoa Fresh, and it's coconut. I like the smell of coconut. It's like coconut and lime almost. That's what it smells like. The Lady Speed Stick. I love it. This is a sample of the Hannah Mori uh, Paris Perfume Spray type deal sample that I got at Sephora. It's very perfumey. I prefer more sweeter scents, as you guys can see. I just kept that one in my purse and then sprayed it every so often. I didn't get any compliments on it, but I liked it. <laughs> Makeup. Okay, so I have two mascaras. Usually I have so many mascaras. This one is the Miss Mongo Rock Voluminous. These are both my favorite mascaras, so I repurchased them a lot. I just had this one in a haul that I repurchased. This one is the Rock, and it's so good. It looks like nothing. The brush is like boring. However, this does wonders. The formula, the brush, and everything. It gives you that spiky, spidery look if that's what you're going for. And this one's quite opposite this one's the voluminous butterfly midnight black this one intensifies your lashes it puts those babies to the sky it goes sky high and it's simple like I'm wearing it today and you guys can see I just did just a couple little layers just to make my eyelashes there for kind of like a, a more toned down look but you can load this up and give you a dramatic look that I've done before so I love these so much. It's not quite empty yet, but I really can't even hold this in my hand anymore or my fingers anymore. So like I can't work with it for my eyebrows. This was the Annabelle Blonde Eyebrow Pencil. So good. I use this all the time on my eyebrows. That's the color I use. And I have only three products left. I feel like this, there's so many things. This is a Kat Von D ink liner in Trooper. Best liquid liner I've ever tried. I keep saying it. I'm sorry if it's annoying. I'm wearing it today. I've repurchased it. So that's a plus because I loved it so much that I went back and repurchased it again. It's kind of expensive. So I patted myself on the back for finding something that I heart so much. Okay, let's do face products last. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. You guys can see I found it on sale for $4 and this was in the shade 320 used it all the way up so I can't even show you the color but if you guys want to google it then it was number 320 it was just kind of like an ivory shade oh honey beige honey beige shade matches natural tone blends seamlessly lets skin breathe those things are all correct when I use that I'm like oh my god it's my favorite ever but now when I'm using my makeup forever I won't go back like I love my makeup forever powder it's flawless honey the very last empties I have is this ready set gorgeous by covergirl fresh complexion oil free foundation in a number 120 this is amazing stuff I bought this for a first impression because you guys asked me to do it for just an everyday wear foundation and I fell in love really and honestly and truly I love this stuff I use it all the way up for just like days when I wasn't really gonna film or sometimes I work while filming I'm just saying like more like kind of chill days or days that I didn't want to wear too much makeup and this is so light and it just blends right in it looks so beautiful and natural as possible so I hope you guys enjoyed this empties video thank you guys so much for watching this and I'll talk to you guys all tomorrow I hope you guys have a great weekend. Bye!